everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Shauna Patterson and today I'm going to be showing you some of the decor items that I've picked up to help decorate my dorm room as I'm moving back to school tomorrow actually. And have I packed one a little bit? No. Put together kind of like a little smorgasbord of new decor items that I'm going to be bringing to my dorm room. If you want to see my dorm room, how I decorated it last year, I have a video up on my channel right now that I'll probably link down below in this video as well because a lot of the stuff I'm just transferring over. But I brought in some new stuff, spruced it up a little bit. So starting off, I am using the same duvet cover as I used last year and you guys can check out what it looks like on my dorm room tour. Put it on this new duvet that I picked up and this is just like a polyester duvet just to make it a little more like puffier and warmer for me. Last semester I used just kind of like a quilt to stuff inside of the duvet cover because I didn't have a queen size duvet but I decided to buy one for this semester and it is huge and so I just put the duvet cover right on top of it for travel purposes and I wanted to see what it looks like. I was shopping around at our dens actually and it's an accessory store so the next thing I'm going to show you is actually technically a scarf but it's a huge scarf and you're going to understand once I show you that I'm actually going to use it as a tapestry wall hanging. Once you put it up on a wall becomes more opaque and you can't see through it. Garf is actually massive and it has all these like tassels on the end. So I thought this would be a perfect cheaper alternative to buying a tapestry. Oh my gosh, I'm like covering up the viewfinder here. Like, look at this. The next thing I purchased was this fluffy giant sheepskin, faux sheepskin rug from Ikea actually. And I think I picked this up for $16 around that. I'm either going to use it as an actual like rug on my floor or else I'm going to drape it over my chair. So we'll find out when I post my dorm room tour what I actually did with it. Probably we'll still be indecisive, but we'll hope, right? So I'm still in the process of making like little DIYs for my room, but I thought I'd throw this in here just to show you guys anyways because I'm moving all my stuff there tomorrow. And it is going to be this huge ream catcher thing, but I still have to add all like the feathers and stuff on it. But actually the cool thing about this is, here you can see the lace pattern better that way. This lace is actually like a little doily that I picked up from my baba, which is like a Russian grandma. It was kind of like a memento that way that I've made my grandma's lace from who knows how old this lace is probably from like the 1930s let's be real so I just took needlepoint hoop is that what you call it and then I just attached the lace doily with fishing line all around the hoop and I wound wine around it and I'm going to add like feathers and everything but you'll see the finished dream catcher once I post my dorm tour as well but I thought I'd just show you guys my ideas right now anyways I'm going to be transplanting some plants that are cactuses but they're all freaking dying I made this planter all the cactuses and like succulents and everything are dying which I'm really sad about so I'm gonna see if I can like transplant it so it'll have like better water drainage and circulation that way so hopefully I don't kill any more cactuses because I'm really sad like <laughs> I've killed a cactus I, those are like the hardest plants to kill but me and my roommate have managed to kill them that in itself is quite a victory <laughs> to kill a cactus bathroom rug this is the same one that I used last year but I'm just using it for like a color reference because I bought a shower curtain but I picked this one up from the dollar store matches perfectly. The turquoise in those little circle medallion things match exactly. And I'm so excited. Like, room decor just gets me pumped up. Ready to party. The last, like, decor item I have is this ukulele. It's not really a decor item per se, but I, like, I know how to play it and it's a musical instrument, but you know, like, it sits up against your wall and, like, it's white, so it works with, like, the theme of my room. Yeah, I know. Is that weird? I had this idea that I'm gonna put, like, washi tape up all over my wall. I found these glitter tapes from Dollarama. Three rolls of it in silver and three rolls of it in gold. We'll see what I come up with to decorate my walls, but I have a lot of ideas up here, so hopefully it works out. So the next portion of this haul video is back to school necessities, like toiletries and stuff like that, to get me started when I move into my new apartment. The first one is this Batiste dry shampoo, and I just picked this up from Marshalls. It's actually cheaper to get it at Marshalls, I've found. Hairspray, Garnier Fructis hairspray, love this stuff. Cotton rounds for my nail polish remover. Olay face wash, Herbal Essences Hydrolicious Conditioner, and some printer ink, because what student doesn't need printer ink? All right, guys, that is the end of my dorm room, like, haul type video. What am I doing with my hands? Just embrace the aroma of poor students. But yeah, if you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already so you can see my videos as soon as I post them, and I'll be talking to you guys soon. Bye!